Check Your Health is sponsored by Intermountain Health and the Utah Department of Health and Human Services. Skiing and snowboarding take a toll on your muscles and joints, so before hitting the slopes, consider doing some conditioning exercises. Around here, we have to deal with altitude, so you really need to make sure that your cardiovascular fitness in the past has exposed you to altitude because you could have issues from the altitude on top of not being fit enough. Whether you're experienced or new to the sport, a preseason conditioning routine will help you gain confidence, strength, agility, and balance. And one of my favorite things to do before the snow actually flies is to hike straight up the ski run. So it's super steep, but get your cardio up because it helps with your muscular endurance. Go hike up so that you experience the altitude change as well. The key muscle groups to focus on are quads, hamstrings, and abs. Trainers suggest adding squats and lunges to your routine. Another common exercise is the lateral hop because remember we want to move in other planes than just forward. So just simply hopping and landing, hopping and landing, making sure that when you land your knee is solid and over your toes and your hips on both sides. Exercise and conditioning will help keep you on the hill and out of the emergency room. It's a high demand sport, but you are definitely less likely and you can mitigate injuries if you do the proper strength training, conditioning, and then also have the proper gear that's fit for, your, for you and for your ability. Mary Nichols, Check Your Health.